Hi guys, welcome back to Rev China. Behind me is Neil's power change station. It's quite a simple kind of boxy feel. So on the left here, you have a house probably for the batteries to that to be changed. On the right hand side, you have a parking space for the whole thing to work. That it is. Today we're not going to review cars from Neil, but we're going to review how this station actually works. Right now, I'm going to start the process. On the screen here, uh, I've got a button here saying start battery change. Click it. Okay, I'm now in the box that is asking me. Um, now, I am only need to press this button and it's going to automatically drive into the battery change position. Right, look, my hands are free, right, my feet are not touching any paddles. The car is automatically driving. You can see where the car is on this small screen here. Now it's reversing back into the position. This is a bit surreal, to be honest. I've tried automatic parking previously, but um, this is something else. Right, it's kind of adjusting its position. It's not in place. Right, we're back a bit more. Okay, we're in. Now, it's asking me to start battery change. So I'll just click it. It's checking the system of the car, probably making sure the small battery in the car. Now, okay, battery change in neutral, self-inspection. Now it's counting backwards, four, three, two, one, zero, start. It's telling me the screen is not going to go black. It may take up to five minutes. Now the whole thing's black, but I can hear a little bit of noise, probably whatever is underneath the cars now. But I can feel the cars moving about a little bit. actually been jacked up. I don't actually know what's going on, but um, we're adding the process of what's on, on the knees by uh, shot by my cameraman. Uh, mm, some noise. It's a bit nerve wracking, to be honest. I can hear boats being taken out. I'm now being lowered. Is that finished? There's some noise still underneath. I'm now being jacked up again. Probably the new battery is coming in. Right, I'm back on the ground. Another Neil just parked in front of me. I think he's probably here for battery changing as well. So I guess this station is, um, could be busy sometimes. Oh, Nomi's back on. I guess the battery is already in. Uh, but uh, my screen is still black. Right, my screen's back on. Previously, before the battery change, I had 91 kilometers of range left and now I have 413 and it's telling me the battery is 92% full. Right, that's it. Unfortunately, I have to drive out myself, which, but anyways, thank you for watching. If you own an electric car, you've probably had the pain on going long hauls for of up to one hour or even two, even if you're on a supercharger, to for the car to charge up. Now, Neil has come up with a alternative solution where you, they are building up a fleet of these powerhouses 
on the highways, you can see one of them for every two or 300 kilometers. Then you can change your battery. It took about five to seven minutes. It's probably just the same amount of time for you to charge up or fill up actually your petrol car. So if you had a choice, which one would you go for?